Okay, let's try this again. Sorry about that, y'all. I uh, I guess I had my my AirPods in, and I guess audio doesn't work on live when you have your AirPods in. But it's so loud out here, uh, cause yeah, I'm at the ocean and there's waves and they're super loud. But anyway, uh, let's try this again. Um, I had a brand new song drop last night. Um, and it's called Other Side. Somebody says audio was fine. Okay, whatever. Um, anyway, I had Other Side drop last night. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Um, and in case you did or did not hear me, uh, Kaiwachi took me out here to, to write together for a few days in Malibu on the coast in California, and it's really pretty. Um, so shout out to him for helping me get out of my house and make music for a few days. and feel better about life. I've just been kind of going through a, a pretty rough <laughs> period, but what's new for me, you know? Um, but I just wanted to hop on here and say thank you to everyone that listened to the song and dropped a comment and said something really kind. Um, thank you to everybody that continues to be here and support me and to show love. It, it seriously means the world to me. And um, I couldn't do this without you all, so... Thank you, for real. And, um, yeah. I have, uh, I have a few more song ideas that I've started. I've kind of had a, a problem with perfectionism recently, so I've, I feel like I've picked up the pen and dropped it so many times. Um, and it's mostly just been my headspace, so thank you all for, you know, being supportive when, uh, I feel like I'm not being very kind to myself and being very supportive of myself. But um, I kind of wanted to come on here and answer a few questions if you guys want to do a little bit of Q&A. Um, and then I'm going to go actually enjoy sitting by the ocean and not sitting on the internet for a while. Um, someone says <laughs> your imperfection could change someone's life I appreciate that I uh yeah it's hard because I think music is perfectly imperfect right I think if uh if music were perfect it wouldn't be as fun to listen to it's like all of the little like cracks and nuances that make things special um and it's like I rationally know that but sometimes I ignore it which is silly um says let me catch up the way you put how we all feel in words but cannot do it ourselves is one of a kind please don't stop I uh, it makes me really happy but it also makes me really sad to know that so many people feel the way that I do you know um, but it's like I don't I don't think I could stop because this is my medicine just as much as it seems to be medicine for other people as well. So don't worry. I'll be here sticking around, making stuff and making music. Somebody says, what DAW do you use? I use Cubase. I'm a Cubase guy. Big hugs from Spain. Big hugs from California. It is really pretty here. I wish I lived here. I wish I was like mega big balling so that I could just like wake up every morning and go walk on the beach and I don't know, ground myself. Somebody says, hope you enjoy some peace by the water. Yeah, I have been. Every morning I've been kind of like coming out here and just like chilling. I've been here, this is my second morning waking up here. It's been really nice. I definitely have beach hair every day, so, you know. Somebody says, you coming to Kai's Florida tour? I wish. It'd be fun. Him and I talked about, uh, I was supposed to do some dates with him uh, last year, but I wasn't ready, uh, which sucks, because we're really good friends. We always have a good time hanging out and, like, making music together, and 
uh, electronic like music, like the EDM world is honestly just like so nice and welcoming. Everybody's been super sweet to me in that space. And um, so I've honestly like anticipated like having more to do with it uh, in a way, just because it seems like a healthy environment and it's fun. It's like less, less pressure and more about collaboration and doing something interesting with a song. Um, somebody said another side I love the broken sounds after the I'm broken line yeah there's a there's a sample of like glass breaking and then I kind of flipped it backwards into the second chorus that was like one of my favorite parts of the song too so I'm glad y'all caught on to that Alex25052 your music gave me hope that my worst to help me keep going thank you I thank you for telling me that um you guys' comments and like telling me how much you resonate with these songs seriously like is everything for me. So I uh, I can't stress that enough. Um, it's literally like the fuel for me to keep going. I I really appreciate it. Uh, someone said, "When are you coming to the Bay Area?" By Bay Area, do you mean like San Francisco? Um, I'm assuming I'm not very cultured. Sorry like California Bay Area. Is this technically a California Bay Area? Probably not. Uh, someone said, how do you make yourself get pen to paper? It's so hard sometimes. Um, I write with a lot of friends. Uh, I write with people that help me um, articulate exactly how I'm feeling and what I'm trying to say. Because um, sometimes I get so like, scatterbrain and kind of um, it gets difficult for me to express how I feel especially when I feel shame and guilt and embarrassment around exactly what it is I feel it's like I need someone to help me get out of the way of myself and so like having friends around is like really important for me when I'm writing music I need that energy and I need that support Someone says next tour. Um, to be honest, um, I okay. I'm just gonna be honest. We were supposed to have a fall tour, and uh, we just like couldn't afford to pull it off. The um, the money that I'm making from music uh, is kind of all just going back into making music. Um, I I haven't really made enough money to like be able to sustain a touring business um so right now it's like i'm just trying to keep my head down and do my best work and like get to a place where i can afford to tour more often because that's the goal that's like that's what's like so rewarding and fun for me so i, I want to get to a place where i can consistently tour um just as an independent artist it's incredibly hard and expensive to do and with inflation going on uh, in the country, like Kai and I were actually talking about it this morning, I think like shows and concerts are down like 30% because it's just so expensive to do it. Um, so I'm trying, hopefully an opportunity presents itself uh, for early next year. But I do not have a lot of money. so. It's just going to take some time, you know. Um, but because all of you are here supporting me and listening and uh, being a part of what Low Spirit is, like, you guys are giving me the chance, like, every day to move forward and build, you know, something that's sustainable and something that can actually afford to tour more consistently. So, again, you guys don't know how much you're appreciated. You guys do everything for me. So, thank you. Um, somebody says another song for your little guy coming yes actually uh, there is another song I'm not going to tell you what it's called though gotta let it be a surprise also guys um, in case you didn't see another way that you can kind of help me out if you want to uh, I just dropped some new merch uh, last Friday um, and it's my favorite line we did a, a stained glass uh, T with like a big like stained glass cassette from the sad songs art um, and it was kind of like a nod at 
if you've been here since day one, uh, if you remember me as Sad Songs Only on TikTok, um, it's kind of like a mesh of like now and then. Um, so it, it's a special drop and it's a special t-shirt. So if you guys want to help me out and support me and pick something up, um, you can go to the merch store through the link in my bio. Um, and even if you can't, just go look at it because I'm really proud of it. We, uh, we took our time designing these things and um, yeah, I care a lot about about merch and art so at least just go look at it and tell me it's cool <laughs> let's see somebody said i'm designing a tattoo based on other side lyrics that's awesome y'all please if you get a tattoo if, god damn these waves are loud um if you get a low spirit tattoo, please tag me in it. I want to see all of them because I think that's the coolest thing. I got to see a couple of y'all's tattoos on tour and it was so sick because it's going to be on your body for the rest of your life. You made the permanent decision of supporting me on your skin forever. And I think that that is crazy. And I've only done that for one band ever, which was AFI. It's the only like only tattoo that I have of like a band related thing on my body but I'll write yeah somebody says Bay Area is California okay that's what I thought um, alright guys I'm gonna go make some lunch but uh please if you have it go jam other side check it out let me know what you think drop a comment on the post um, and yeah, if you want to support, go check out the merch store. I love you all very much. Thank you for hanging out with me. I appreciate you. Thank you for being there when my life gets really, really rough. Um, you having this Instagram and TikTok and everything, it's like my personal like diary and journal and it helps me cope. So you guys are my family, my community. I love you all very much and I will see you soon.